Hi, I'm Joey, the self-quarantine cook. I'm going to show you today how to make simple family recipe for deviled eggs. Happy Easter, by the way. Okay, I'm going to try to make this quick. I've already done the boiling of the eggs and the shelling, which is my least favorite part. And I'm going to put this together and show you how to do this. You'll need uh, one and a half cups of mayo, some fresh paprika, two tablespoons of dill, two tablespoons of yellow mustard, and then in this case I'm doing 18 eggs, which is nine boiled eggs, and you cut them in half so it's going to make 18 all together. Okay, so first you take your mayo, which I already have prepared in it. To your bowl, throw your mustard in, and your dill. Now you can use sweet relish if you want to, but I prefer the dill. I like the kind of sour taste it gives it. And you throw a little bit of salt and pepper in here too. Now you're going to take each egg, cut it in half, and you're going to take your yolks and put them into the mixture. It's a little bit tedious, but you have to have it. In the end, you're going to take the yolks and you're going to Make sure your mayo, mustard, dill, and egg yolk together, and you're going to refill the insides of these eggs. They usually don't last long around our house, so I have to make quite a few. every holiday that we had. She was quite the cook. So, I'm just using a spoon. You can use a whisk or whatever so that you can smash the egg yolk into your mixture. And you get it very consistent. Okay, yeah. you're going to end up with a batter that looks like this. So here, and I'm just going to do the first one to show you what it's going to look like. You just want it to kind of be a little bit over the edge. And you want it to be nice and thick so that it doesn't run over the side of the egg. And you're going to put a little bit of paprika on the top just to give it a nice look. And there you go. And that is uh, Jane's recipe for deviled eggs.